Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's a keeper. Get him on shore. Hey guys, what's going on? It's Logan coming at you from Hunting Pros and welcome back to another one. I apologize for sounding congested today. I'm just getting over a pretty nasty head cold. But nevertheless, I'm going out fishing today with my buddy Chad. He has a private little camp on a private little lake and we're gonna troll it for some trout today. So I'm super stoked for that. We tried to do this a couple weeks ago and I'm sure most of you guys know me who watch my fishing content. For trout, I typically run just a spinner hook and worm. And that's exactly what I did last time in this lake and I didn't catch a thing. But what's really funny about it to me is my buddy Chad used a Rapala style lure and he was hammering them. Like he, he caught two really oh, nice yeah, trout. That's a nice one. I didn't even get a bite. So I'm kind of curious to know if that was just a one time thing or if for some reason in this lake they just really like Rapalas. Um, but anyway, today I'm going to be running a Lucky Strike Spoon, Hook and Worm, and Chad's going to try the same type of Rapala and we'll see what happens. If you guys enjoyed this video, please slap the like button and also subscribe and make sure you stick around till the end. Thanks. Careful starting that big motor, Chad. Okay. Got me. My guess, one pull. You guessed right. <laughs> Good old live bait versus Rapala. Take two. Take two. <laughs> Fish on. <laughs> that didn't take long, buddy. <laughs> That's funny. Sometime tonight we're gonna hit him all right back. <laughs> That's oh. funny. I, I set the rod down and I seen uh, <laughs> I seen the, I seen it go. <laughs> I don't know if there's much of a size to him or. It didn't look like much. Oh no, not much. Pan fryer. Uh, let's throw him back. Yeah, I'll throw him back. There's so much jumping going on. We're gonna try the fly rod in that little cove over there. Look at them. They're all jumping all behind the boat there, right here. Right next to it. I'm just gonna try all through here. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Oh, he went for it. Do you see that? Yeah. Fish on. Fish on. Oh, man. Fish on. Fish off. <laughs> <laughs> He tasted it. There's just a sandwich laying in a cooler. Well, I, put, I just put them in there. Yeah. No, I took it out of the. Th I took it out of the. Oh wrapper. yeah, but I, I thought they were just laying in the bottom oh, of the cooler. No. <laughs> <laughs> Got a little hitchhiker on me, bud. Nice fly. <laughs> well, we're gonna try a brook. Go for a little walk and uh, see what happens. Yes, sir. Geez, it turned into a beautiful night. It's hard to believe on the other side of this little cove how windy it was. Jesus, here. It's, over there. Yeah, it's beautiful here. Yeah. That, there's a little pond through here, through this mess, right there. Okay. I wanted to try it, but there's very few fish in that area. Really okay. So what, where do you think is best further up? We'll try that on the way back, maybe. Brought the fly rod and the spin cast just to see what we're getting into here. Yeah, I'll try. I think I'm gonna try the fly rod because there's a few like good ones surfacing here. Let's see what happens. I just don't know how deep this is to wait out, so. I have no idea either. Ooh, ooh. Is that right next to you? Here and over there. Yeah, you should get something, man. Still using the old Rapala? Yeah. Oh boy. Yeah, that's over the waders. Oh 
It's not that bad, it just kind of splashed up over a little bit. That should be a fish right there. It's right next to where he rose. Did you catch one? Yeah, but it's just a little back. Oh, well, hey, it's still a fish. Still a fish. Geez, he doesn't look that bad. I'm, I'm tossing back. What is it, like seven or eight inches? Six. Okay, I can't really tell from here. <laughs> Didn't really want to take the fly, so I'm going to try. Uh, Old Faithful here. Oh yeah. <laughs> a little one, but yeah. That's for you if you want to keep that one. Keep those too. Right? No, no. I'm... I don't care what you keep. He's right fat, but he's not that big. He's probably like seven inches or something. I mean, I've kept them that size, definitely, for like pan trope, but... But I'll release them. Yeah, that seems like a nicer fish, maybe. Can't tell. Oh yeah, that's a. I'm keeping that one. It stays on. That would be nice, huh? Yeah, that's a keeper there. That's a nice trout. That guy's gonna go in the creel. I think maybe the uh, the Lucky Strike Spinner and Worm is doing a little better than that Rapala over there. Oh yeah. Fish on. <laughs> he ain't very big. <laughs> he played nice at first. And then all of a sudden it, <laughs> yeah, you're swimming with, with me reeling, I think. Let him go back. They're getting nice and kind of plump this time of year though. Yeah, they're fighting a nut now. Well, they're eating fly, right? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's a keeper. Get him on shore. <laughs> Oh yeah, man, that's a nice trout. <laughs> wow, that's a nice one. That is a beautiful trout, man. Wow. Nice and fat. Wow, this little little hole definitely holds some nice fish, dude. What do you think, Chad? I got my house. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, another nice one, man. That was literally right at my feet by shore. I know. Yeah, it's on the shore. I look over and just throw it on the shore. Dude, he that's a that's a nice trout. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> you followed him in, buddy. <laughs> like, why not? Look at the colors on that guy, man. Wow. He's got like a beautiful, like, pink stomach. How'd you make out, Mr. Rapala? Landed one, threw it back, <laughs> hooked another, unintentionally threw it back. <laughs> Perfect. Yeah, I caught five, kept three nice ones. And uh, threw two back, so not too bad. Beautiful. Well, guys, Chad and I trolled for a good portion of the day. Um, we got caught in a thunderstorm, so we turned around and went back to Chad's camp. Played some guitar, ate some food and whatnot. Anyway, we went out trolling again. I caught one small one from the boat. Um, nothing that crazy, so we threw it back. So we ended up going for a walk through this little wood path to a little still water area um, where a little brook runs in. And uh, we landed a few trout. I kept three nice ones, so uh, that's great. This is a cool bridge, man. We, uh, I one time brought a stove across here with a snowmobile on it and a sled. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> I think you have a lake up there. 
There wasn't a handrail on it then, but the, were, the skis were on both sides of the bridge. Oh, right. Yeah, and you just towed it up That's funny. Well, we made it back. And there's still some wind on, but we're in the lee here. No yeah, no, that, that, that was definitely worth the walk, though. Oh, yeah. It's not that far. Three nice trout. It's not even far walk. No.